and a warm welcome and appreciate each and every one of you for saying yes to our invite, for taking time from your busy schedules to come and celebrate with us as a mark of a very interesting journey and I hope you will agree with me that it has been an interesting journey when you listen to the stories that are going to be shared this afternoon. Is it still the afternoon? Early evening. Um, for body comfort, please, there are restrooms. Just the floor below, um, next to the reception area, uh, just behind the reception area, you, you will find the restrooms. So please um, listen to your body. And when there's a sense that you might need to uh, take a body break, you are welcome to do that uh, silently. Uh, so that we do not... <laughs> that is coming from Fatima, and I understand why. <laughs> uh, please note, this is a no-smoking building. Uh, should you have the edge to honor the one of the other body needs, I would like to believe that it becomes one of them after some time. Uh, you are welcome to, I think, do that outside. Tato, is that the, yes, wonderful. Thank you so much for that. Um, the exit um, doors are clearly marked. Should we need to use them at any stage, just outside this building where we are? And again, if you look on your tables, we have supplied a list with all the partnerships that will be sharing their journeys today. You are welcome to tweet. Um, we have supplied the details, the hashtag details, and uh, also uh, the, what do you call them, Emma? Twitter details as well. Twitter handle, there we go. Moving with the times. So Twitter handle, we have it in front of you, and, and the hashtag. So you're welcome at any time to please uh, tweet about the event that you are part of. Uh, also, our partners will be um, sharing their stories and the stories will be recorded. So I have a special request to you partners to please, because there's a particular process that we need to honor and follow uh, as a request from Yolandi, that if you can just stay in one place when you are doing your presentation, I know it's not the easiest of things. I'm feeling the urge to move as I'm Standing here right now, I'm reminded of my seven-year-old who can't keep still. <laughs> um, at the same time, I think it's just going to be a useful practice to ensure that we capture the experience in a way that we can treasure for years to come. So please be mindful of that. So you might be wondering and maybe asking yourself some questions. What's the reason I'm here today? Some of us are here. Uh, as partners to our partners for possibility. Some of you are here as work colleagues. Some of you are here as Symphonia team. And some of you are here as uh, school leaders. And some of you are here as learners who are going to share their talent with us. So we all here from a particular space in time and here for a particular reason. And the reason is simply this. You are here to listen to the story of us. This started being a story of the self when one wonderful lady had a vision, when one lady was dead, when one lady was moved, and she couldn't contain the edge anymore. And she shared the story. And as somebody listened to the story, it became a story of us. And it became a story of us because there was a connection. Somebody who was listening to that story connected to what was moving this lady. And as the connection happened, it stopped being the story of us. It became the story of now. Because when you are away, you translate that awareness 
to action. And the story of now meant that strategies and processes needed to be considered. How are we going to, to be the agents of change? How are we going to be active citizens? How are we going to be creative in solving the education crisis in our country? And the Partners for Possibility was birthed from being a story of the self to the story of us and to the story of the now. And you are here today because you are going to be listening to the journeys that the partners have been having of translating the story of self to story of us. And hopefully, it's going to be a story of now for all of us as we hear about how we can be partners in changing the education in our country. So welcome. And I would like you to, to relax and enjoy the evening as we give you a powerful South African welcome through music. And for that, I'm going to call our beautiful young ladies and gentlemen from Tembisa Secondary School. And they're going to welcome us with songs, just a couple of them. Mr. Mwani, thanks to you and your team, we hand over to you.